people love going to the beach. Thousands flock to the beautiful sandy beaches of the Lake Huron shoreline every summer, visitors and cottagers alike. But those thousands have an impact. They can, unintentionally, harm the very thing they're there to enjoy. So the beaches need protecting and maintaining. And that's the mission of the Goderich-based Lake Huron Center for Coastal Conservation. Some of our beaches are starting to show signs of degradation and we want to try and prevent that. And so it's important for people to understand how beaches operate, how they function. And so the more they understand about that, the more able we're going to be able to pr protect these features and to uh, provide them for future generations. A beach actually has three parts, the open sandy area, the near shore water, and dunes a little further inland. And they all operate as one system. You can't have one without the other. And so how they function is that the sand dunes act as a sand reservoir. It's that bank for, uh, that stores the sand for, for the future. It's all about the cycles of nature. Calm waves carry the sand on shore. The wind blows the sand inland, creating and replenishing the dunes. Then high lake levels and storms carry the sand offshore, forming sandbars. Then the calm waves repeat the process, and on it goes. And if we interrupt any part of that cycle, that's when we start to get degraded beaches. And so that's what we're trying to prevent, is that degradation. And so one of the key things is to protect and preserve our sand dunes as that reservoir of sand that uh, the, the lake needs to borrow from time to time and to maintain this beach and that cycling effect. And if we lose our sand dunes, then our beach degrades. Some of the things that we can do include planting native plants like beach grass. We can also work to properly access the waterfront or the beach area through the dunes. There's a, there's a right way and a wrong way to access the water. We can also use sand fencing to manage blowing sand on a beach. Invasive species are also a threat to a healthy dune. So we'll work with landowners along the shoreline to identify invasive plants and help eradicate them. The Lake Huron Center for Coastal Conservation is working on those four key methods to protect the dunes and provide resources for people who want to help, including instructional videos on its website. Nature balances everything out, so when we get involved, we sometimes interfere with that balance and upset it. So if we can learn about how these processes function and have a bit of more of an understanding of how we can play a role in protecting the, uh, the dunes and the beaches, then uh, we have a good future ahead.